people. Most, most of you, for the most part. And let me tell you something, all that matters in life is if you're hot. Do you understand me? That's all that matters. I was raised by an Irish immigrant mother and a blue collar father, and I was told that if I worked hard, got educated, and did the right thing, that life would reward me. What a load of crap that is. <laughs> Life is rewarding Paris Hilton, the Kardashians, and those freaks at the Jersey Shore. <laughs> Let me ask you, what does Paris Hilton do? I mean, really, other than men and drugs, what does that chick do? She was recently caught with cocaine. I would have been a lot more shocked had she been caught with a book. <laughs> I got married a few years ago. Oh, whatever. Now, I got married because I deal in reality. I realized my stock was going down, I had to lock in. <laughs> I understood I had to sell while somebody was still buying. <laughs> if I look like Bambi over here, I would be whoring around for another 10 years. <laughs> but I don't, if I don't blow dry this hair, I look like Medusa screwed buckwheat. <laughs> Bambi, Medusa's a Greek lady with snakes coming out of her head. I got married because I deal in reality. There is a double standard in our society. It doesn't matter how old or ugly a man is. As long as he is famous or wealthy, he will get sex to the day he dies. <laughs> Women, we have a shelf life of about 35, 40 with good refrigeration. <laughs> I did not make this up. I learned this from Anna Nicole Smith, my spiritual advisor. <laughs> Anna was married to an octogenarian in a wheelchair. That's a man in his 80s, Bambi. <laughs> he hadn't walked since Watergate. A political crisis in the 1970s. <laughs> and he got Anna Nicole Smith. Come on! It doesn't work the same way for old chicks. Joan Rivers is wealthy, and she can walk. She's not getting any action. I mean, I don't think so. Though somebody should explain to her that having eyes in the back of your head is just an expression. <laughs> but I know how women can succeed. I've done the work so you don't have to. Killing, <laughs> killing can help a career. Let me tell you, I watched 60 Minutes. I know what's happening. There's a woman in jail right now because she killed her husband. I don't know her name. Let's just call her Killer. <laughs> killer killed her husband because he was battering her. So, you know, he had it coming. She got a prison sentence as she deserved. You know what else she got? Come on. Book and a movie deal. <laughs> Book and a movie deal. Because she killed her husband. <laughs> I was an English major. I know how to conjugate verbs. I know how to diagram sentences. I know the proper use of semi-colons. <laughs> Semi-effin' colons. <laughs> Separates independent clauses. Those are full sentences, the noun, the verb, the object, <laughs> noun, verb, object. But I can't get a book and a movie deal because I didn't kill anybody. But it's my own fault because I'm the idiot who married a man who respects me. <laughs> Let me tell you something, my father's an alcoholic. Whose isn't? Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Cry me a river. Do you know how many daughters of alcoholics marry abusers and batterers? Any clue? Like 98%. Not me. I couldn't even get that right. <laughs> I got the good guy, the nice guy. Hey, Maureen, can I help you? What can I do? Can I cook? Can I clean? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? What can I do? Get off of me. You know what you can do? You can hit me. So I can shoot you. That's what you can do. I can see the headlines now. Comic kills her husband. She gets a book and movie deal. I can dream. I can dream. I'm Maureen Langan. You better create Fox. Thank you.